Your words fall to the ground. Samuel, in our passage today, was faithful with his first prophetic task. On answering the call from God as a boy, it's revealed to Samuel that the apostasy of Eli's sons will not go unpunished. This had to be a profoundly difficult message to be given. The man who was like a father to Samuel, who had helped Samuel to be able to answer God's call in the first place, is the recipient of a prophetic message of divine judgment that Samuel is to deliver. And Samuel does. He doesn't hold anything back from Eli about what God said. And the passage concludes with the fruit of that decision. God was with Samuel and let none of his words fall to the ground. And all in Israel knew that Samuel was a trustworthy prophet of the Lord. God kept Samuel's words from failing, from falling to the ground, because Samuel didn't try to twist them, cherry-pick them, or wield them as weapons. 